Hey friends and family, this is SP News Nugget, and today we are talking about Wendy Williams' son. This is Kevin Hunter Jr., and he was in court June the 25th, and you guys, I've got the clip of the court hearing, so you guys need to see what happened, okay? So if you're part of the family already, thank you for being part of the family. I appreciate you guys very much. I, I really do. But if you're not part of the family, it's easy to do so. Click, click on that button and subscribe to the channel. There's a bell right next to it. That's for notification. So when we upload a video, you receive it as fast as we can get it to you. Down below in the comment sections, after looking at the video, this is how we communicate. We talk down to each other in the comment section. And I read every last one of them. I really, truly do. You will see a little heart with, you know, me there just letting you know that I seen your comment and sometimes I do comment back it all depends if you like the video give me a thumbs up and if you don't like the video give me a thumbs down and thank you and here we go Okay, you guys, so you see Kevin Hunter Jr., he pleaded not guilty. Now, Kevin Hunter Sr. did not even show up for court, you guys. But it was reported, or Wendy, Wendy wasn't even there. But it was reported that they did drive up um, to the courthouse together. So it was reported that Kevin Sr. and Wendy was in a car together at the courthouse but they did not go in. So, you guys know that Kevin Hunter Sr. said that he was not going to pursue on um, pressing charges. But, you know, he really doesn't have to. The minute that you have the police involved, and especially if it's a domestic violent case, the state picks up the charges. And then you have to come to court. Even if you are the... Um, the one that's, you know, got offended. And um, so Kevin is really still upset that him and Kevin Jr. are not speaking and talking. It's one word sentence, you know, one word like, hey, how you doing? You know, good. <laughs> and and that's not, that's not nice. But, you know, you guys, when you have a family, you guys know how it works. And you split up. One kid, or two, or whatever, they're going to defend the one that they feel close or bond with. And Kevin Sr. probably had a very good bond with this boy. But Kevin Jr. probably seen all the things that he's done. So, I mean, there's always a learning lesson in there for, for anyone. I mean, just looking at, even though that, you know, Wendy Williams is a star celebrity, you know, and talk whole show got her own show and everything we all gonna have the same kind of problems they're just gonna be on a different you know kind of um, platform 
you know, and 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 that that's that's not that's just the way life is. Just basically, that's the way life is. But anyway, let me share with you guys. So, Wendy is um, thinking about moving to Los Angeles and the show also, you guys. Now, it's just a rumor right now. It's just a rumor. I, you know, I hope she don't do that because you see what happened to Steve Harvey when he moved his whole show to a whole different state and fired everybody and it just didn't go well. And look where he's at now. So, maybe Wendy want to get clear far away from Kevin Hunter as possible. She says she still love him and and I understand that that's her husband. And uh even I know I know he's done a lot wrong, but we can't feel what she feels. She knows the interperson, the man and um the sad thing about the whole situation you guys and I'm going to share this with you that um, Wendy really doesn't say anything bad about Kevin Hunter, but he's always saying something bad about her. And that's just strange to me. He was like, she's lazy. She didn't want to do this and do that. And, you know, and she's lying about this. And, and I think the only reason why she came out and told everybody that she was in a drug rehab or for alcohol is because it was probably held over her head that they were going to tell. So she just went and, you know, she got in front of it before everybody else. That's what you do. You get in front of the narrative before everybody else. And you write your story however you want, you know. So, I mean, Wendy, I, I just hope that they work it out. But anyway, you guys heard what the judge said. Let's get back on to Kevin Hunter Jr. The judge said that he will return in two weeks. So in two weeks, we'll have an update on... On what's going on and you guys I'll try to keep you guys posted I'm getting a little bit better I got a little bit behind and I'm sorry for that but when you're learning new things and you're trying to you know you get kind of little I get I get a little agitated and frustrated because things don't work out the way I wanted to but just be patient with me by the time I learn all of this stuff you guys we're gonna be going live so we're gonna have all kind of conversations so I love you guys be good, be safe, and be nice to each other. Bye.